Okay, well, I decided to put on new rear drum brakes on the Sienna. You can see that the pads, the shoes are really thin, especially in the front one. And the back one isn't so bad. But I got it all off. I took my pictures. You can see over here, I got pictures everywhere. I got a spring kit in case I need it. I'll probably just replace them. Got my new shoes. They came with pins in them, which is really nice. Um, don't have to worry about putting in pins. It already came that way. It came with new little horseshoe guys. So I'm going to try to start taking this thing apart. And shouldn't be impossible to do based on what I've done before. So looking at this, I guess I'm going to start with this little guy down here. My new patented Scotty Kilmer um, light, which works really well, by the way. But if I can't get this first spring out of the way. Okay, I got it. Wow. That was interesting. I'm taking a picture, so I should know where everything goes. I'm going to set everything down the way I find it. Okay. Um, this thing should come out pretty easy. It fits just like that on that pin right there. And underneath this little guy fits in there like a little puzzle piece and underneath this guy. So that pulls out nice. Fits like that. Okay, um, that's the brake, parking brake. Uh, the next thing to do is a uh, little guy over here. Let me take it off. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Take that off. Let everything fall apart. Probably. I'm wondering how much of this I can just pull off when I take these off. Well, this has to come off anyway, so I'm going to take it off. So it fits right in there, like so. That one came off easy, which is nice. We got a new spring set. I got to see if it's the right thing. I guess so now all this junk in here is. Underneath that. And hopefully that will all just come out. I'm going to take this shoe out rather than having to figure it out because that looks really freaking complicated. Grab it. Hold the thing on the other side. As you recall, bringing taking them off is no problem. It's putting them back on. That's a pain. Ooh, unless they're really tight like these guys. See, I got the one off by holding the pin in the back, pushing. Oof. Whoa, ah, that was handy. Came off all by itself. How nice. Now, question is, how has this thing come apart? Will it come off easy, or is there more something I have to take apart? What on earth are these things? Is this something that you need a special tool for? Likely. It's under, it's that pin, and it fits under that little silver piece right there. So that just comes off like so, and that tab fits in that place, okay. That just comes off like so. I wonder if I just tighten that, or put that so these come together, I'm going to take that spring off. I think now that spring's probably too dang tight. I'll do that. I'm going to screw this in and then maybe be able to take these off. I'll try that. Oh, look at this one. Alright, let's see if I can get this little bugger off here now. Because now it feels pretty loose. I don't 
No, this is gonna come off easy or not. Well, keep, keep screwing it in, maybe. Full like that, and this thing fits like that, and you worm it in so it's inside there. And then this is the whole piece that came off. I got this damn thing out by using this clamp, clamping the brake shoe, and then using these crummy Chinese things, and then I actually pulled the spring out. So now here's the whole thing. Now I gotta match everything up. I am gonna clean that sucker, because that's useless. Okay, I took pictures of this thing to make sure I could put it back together, I hope. I'm trying to take these little C clamps off of here. So I've clamped that one down, and I'm trying to twist it open a little bit. Get it to a point where I should be able to... Oops. I should be able to push it off. So let's see if that... If I can get this guy in there, or a screwdriver in there, I think I can slip it off. I'm a different screwdriver. Oh wait, there it comes. Good. There's one. So let's try that trick again. Let's find a place where I can hold that thing kind of in place. I'll loosen this thing until I can squish it down. Problem is, it's so. No room for all this, and the equipment that I'm using is not real good. Let me find a better screwdriver. A skinnier screwdriver. This is a skinny screwdriver. Whew, standing up after being on your knees for a thousand years. It's not a good idea. Ah, look at that. The right tool, dummy. That'll work now. Now I got her. Well, off it comes. Good. Oh, it came off. Thank you, Lord. Okay, so that just flipped, came off right there. Okay, so it'll fit on the new piece. Right like that. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Now, this will just come off of this once this comes off. What happened? That was like this. This was like this. And that just fell right off. Let's put it back in so that I know what it did. Did one that hole? This must have been around there. This must have been in this hole. There we go. Looks like that. So this comes off like so. This just drops out like that. This. Goes on like that. This. This one on like this, that one in like this, and then this guy went on like that. I believe. Yeah. There it goes. There it goes. And then it's got those two new guys stuck on there like that. Good. I think I got it. I want to pull this thing apart because it it really needs 
um, tender love and care, I think. I have to be clean, I think. <laughs> 